Hey guys, um, it's Ab Elliot here. I just wanted to make a quick video about this idea of shifting things in your life and letting go what no longer serves you. And oftentimes, um, when we do have something in our life that isn't serving us, we have a lot of resistance about it inside. And we're saying, this isn't good and I need to change it or and I can't be happy. I won't be happy until I won't be my best self until I until I shift or change this external circumstance. What I think is a good idea to do is to look at our internal environment, our internal world, our internal mind before we make any shifts on the outside. Unless you're in a situation where you're being abused uh, in a real manner, uh, mentally or physically, um, then you might want to get out and change your environment. But if it's just relationships not working out, I'm not happy with this person and we don't seem to be clicking anymore, or my job is just, I'm just not happy with my job, or whatever it might be, something that you want to change in your life, um, I think it's always a good idea to look at the inside first and come to a calm and still place so that we can really be objective and be free from our own attachment and clinging and aversion to whatever it is we want to change. So something to think about. Um, and ways you can do this are by starting a meditation practice, a mindfulness practice. And another technique I've used time and time again to get myself out of this I, this ego, this need to be right, is to say exactly that. Say, I now release my need to be right and, and use this over and over in my mind. If I'm upset about something and I'm really toiling in misery or you know, I'm just saying, this is just not working and I, you know, I need to change this and this, you know, at least I'll say, I now release my need to be right to relieve myself of some of that misery so that I can make a decision from a place of peace instead of a place of panic. So try it out. Try getting yourself into a better place before you shift and see, see if there's a difference. Maybe some of the problem is you, in fact. Maybe there's some things you need to shift about yourself before shifting the external circumstances because we can rearrange the external circumstances all we want, but we're the only common denominator in our life. And so if we have a problem over here and then we start a relationship with, ship with that person over there, and then we shift that and then we're, we, we start another one over here, we find out that we just keep changing the chess pieces in, to different places on the board and we're never really dealing with the person who's moving them, the person who's responsible for the decisions and for the beliefs and for the way they feel. So if we deal with ourselves first, and we deal with our own minds, and get to a place of stillness, then we can always make better decisions, and the, the, best, the worst thing that happens is you become more peaceful first. So you're just going to feel better. So something to think about, and I hope you have a wonderful day, and make the best decision that's, that's possible for you, and release yourself first, so that you can, you can absolutely make the best decision possible for you. Peace and I love you. Bye-bye.